Now to keep the budget down in that bath, we used a material like this for the tub surround. We also used it as a skirt and apron area around this whirlpool. It's called cultured marble and it's a great budget solution because it's much less expensive than a tile shower or surround, but it's more substantial than a prefabbed hollow acrylic type shower or tub. It's also pretty cool to see this stuff made. Cultured marble, as the name implies, is very different from real marble, but it does contain real marble, marble dust. Bags of the marble dust are mixed together with a polyester resin in large vats to form what looks like cake batter. When the marble batter is thoroughly mixed, it's poured and scooped into molds to create the desired profiles. These molds are waxed beforehand and sprayed with a gel coat that's similar to the process used on fiberglass boat hulls. The wax will help the pieces release from the molds later and the gel coat will create a slick hard surface on the outside of the material. Depending on what's being made, the molds may be simple or complex, but the important thing is that there are no bubbles in the mixture when it dries. This would ruin the illusion of a smooth marble-like finish, so the molds are vibrated on special tables to ensure that all of the air in the batter is released. In some cases, a secondary mold is added to contain large recesses like sinks. When the resin cures and the marble is stable, it's removed from the forms. Any rough edges left around the pieces from the forms are ground off from the back side. The front, or the finished surface of the marble, is buffed and polished to create a beautiful shine and a surface that will resist the wear and tear of a bathroom. Another thing that's great about cultured marble, it's so versatile. You can use it on almost any surface in your bathroom except the floor. And it's fairly durable. This material's been in here about 18 years and has a few little chips on it here and there. So it will chip. You have to be careful with that. And I have seen a few burns that are a result of a curling iron being left on a little bit too long. But overall, great material. I'll tell you the truth, it's held up a lot better than the cabinets in this bathroom.